Hi, my review is on the movie The Immortals, which opened up on November 11th, starring uh, Henry Cavill and Mickey Rourke. And uh, some, I have a little bit of a summary here of, of the movie. Thesis is a mortal man chosen by Zeus to lead the fight against the ruthless king Hybrian, who is on a rampage across Greece to obtain a weapon that can destroy humanity. Um, I saw the movie and uh, I have to say that I, I really, I, I really wasn't blown away by this movie. Um, it's one of those kind of movies like uh, Clash of the Titans, 300, you know, those ancient times kind of movies. And I like those kind of movies. I like, you know, I, I'll, I'll admit I did like the last Clash of the Titans movie. I mean, I wasn't, I didn't think, you know, I don't think it was great, but I... I thought it was good. I mean, I thought it was okay. This movie, though, however, and I've seen 300. I thought 300 was excellent. But I saw this movie, The Immortals, and I got to tell you, I really was not impressed. Uh, there were good, there was, there was neat battle scenes in the movie. Um, there were some times of excitement and all that. But overall, there were moments where the movie just dragged and seemed boring at times. And, uh, I don't know, it it just did not seem like a kind of movie that I, I, I enjoyed. I mean, and even, you know, like Mickey Rourke's character, you know, he's got this big helmet, you know, it's like a gothic-looking helmet dress or, you know, headdress or whatever, like, you know, they had back in those times. But this thing looked like a rabbit. It had, like, rabbit ears on it, you know. It looked like, a, like it had rabbit ears. It looked like... Uh, you know, like, it reminded me of a guy in a bunny suit or something. You know, I just, I don't know. I, I the movie just, uh, I don't know. The mo movie just didn't seem, um, you know, like it was great. Um, some of the acting in it was okay. I think Henry Cavill did, you know, did okay. But there were some, you know, the character, some of the dialogue on some of the characters was pretty tacky and cheesy. Um, and I really wasn't impressed with the CGI backdrop in the movie. You know, you could tell it was fake. Now, when they did similar stuff like that with 300, that was cool because it was meant to be that way with 300. But the, but the CGI they used in this movie just looked, did not look very good. And, you know, uh, I, I just... I, I wasn't really crazy about this movie at all. Um, probably, you know, I, but but I think there there were some good things about it. It wasn't perfect, you know. There were some exciting moments, you know, the battles and stuff like that. You know, if you like these kind, those kind of movies, but uh, but overall, I wasn't really that impressed. I mean, you know, um, uh, you know, the movie isn't getting good reviews, but uh, I really wasn't impressed by it. And, uh, you know, so I would say, you know, maybe you should just go and, um, you know, see something else because this movie just didn't do it for me. It just, I mean, the action scenes were good, you know, there were, there were good action scenes in the movie, there were good special effects, and, you know, some, some of the special effects were okay. But overall, I'd have to say the movie would, it just, uh, it just kind of blew, you know, it just, for me, it, it just blew, and, uh, um, you know, but that's my review, I, you know, I mean, it was, I don't know, I'd, I'd like to say that it was good, but I can't, you know, I mean, maybe I give it one of these, but it should have been a better film than it was, um, um it just, it just, it didn't captivate me, it entertained me just a little bit, um, but, it had its moments that I guess that were okay, but overall the movie just, I don't know, it just bored me to death, you know. I just felt bored when I watched this movie. Um, it just, you know, I don't know, it just didn't seem like the kind of movie that, I, uh, that it was entertaining. And, you know, that's just my verdict on it, and uh, that's my review, and, uh, you know, I give it one of these or that, you know, but... Uh, but that's it. Uh, that's just where I stand on this movie. So, everybody, take care, and uh, until my next review. All right, everybody, take care.